Hey, so we got some extras. I don't know what these include. Cave Johnson here. Every time I look at our test chamber production line, I am reminded of my father. Now, he wasn't a scientist, just a simple farmer, a professor of farming at the local farm college. Never farmed a day in his life, but his theories on farming are the backbone of this company. Do it from scratch. Spare no expense. And never cut corners. Well, that's a corner-cutting machine. We obviously cut them there. Point is, we've always done things the way my father did. And his father before him, and his father before him, and his father before him. And we are almost bankrupt. So, time for a cheaper approach. Allow me to introduce the multiverse. Infinite Earth with an infinite number of apertures. And as of now, they are going to take over all test chamber construction. And more importantly, all paying for test chamber construction. Why are they agreeing to do that? They're not. We're tricking them. Here's how it works. One, design a test. Two, slip the mole monsters or what have you the blueprint when they're not looking. Three, once they build it, steal it back. Look at that sad little octopus. <laughs> That's where you come in. We need blueprints. We are about to run the greatest con game in the history of the multiverse, and you are the bottleneck. Yes, you. Get back to work. Okay, Cave Johnson. So, that's why only the white panels are capable of holding portals, is because they're made of moon rock. Okay, I don't think this will be anything, but I can always edit these out, they're not. These next tests require cooperation. Consequently, they have never been solved by a human. That's where you come in. You don't know pride. You don't know fear. You don't know anything. You'll be perfect. Test chamber completed. Continue testing. Continue testing. Continue testing. The two of you have forged an excellent partnership. Now it's time for your real purpose. Don't disappoint me. Or I'll make you wish you could die. That's right, Atlas and Peabody. They're kind of cool. And we already know Gladys wakes up, because we played the game. It's been a long time. How have you been? 